Taylor's brisket. I want to show you what it looks like. This is how it's cut. That's your little fat there. And it has a very good smoke flavor to it. Now, one of my friends complained. She said to her it was a little salty. You know how sometimes smoked meat has had a little salt to it? But what I do is I add a little Worcestershire sauce to it. And this has a low sodium. And so I put a little bit of that at the bottom because it tells you to put water at the bottom of the thing that you're going to cook it in and wrap it in foil. And I use a little Worcestershire sauce and I use a little water. I'm going to cover it up in the foil. And that's all I do to it. I mean, and this is this is perfect. Like um, like I told you, a lot of the catering, uh, the, the catered events that I attend, wedding receptions, birthday parties, everybody has started going to Sam's and using this. So if you think your caterer may have smoked that meat and all that, it may have possibly come from Sam's. But this is what it looks like. That's the texture, and this is the thickness of it. And, and I haven't had one that was bad. Every one I've gotten have been good. Okay. Okay, so I wrapped the foil up and now it's ready to go in the oven. 325, I think it is. I'm going to put it in there about an hour because I don't have very much. This is what was left over from um, Christmas. I don't like to keep my, um, like if I fix gumbo or something and I have it left over within that next month, I want to go ahead and eat it. I don't like to keep it in the refrigerator or freezer too long. Well, I'm sorry, in the freezer too long. So I'm going to show you what it looks like um, when it's finished.